Vlogmas. Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Um, as you can probably tell by the title of this video, I decided to do Vlogmas this year. Um, I'm going to do a weekly vlog um, each week of December to show you a bit of real life in Sydney and kind of the build up to Christmas. So today is the 28th of November and I thought I would start this week because the 1st of December is on Wednesday and there's a couple of events and stuff. Um, I thought that we were going to go for lunch today and we were going to go and buy a Christmas tree. We haven't bought a Christmas tree for the whole time we've been in Australia so we haven't had one for the past two years but this year it feels Christmassy for the first time which is thanks to the terrible weather we're having. So um, the positive side is that it actually feels quite Christmassy and we're feeling quite festive so um, yeah it's annoying because we've had rain for the past week in Sydney so anyone that's not from Sydney or Australia this is our summer and it's normally boiling hot by now and constantly sunny and it's been really crap recently so um, really annoying but yeah I guess the positive is that it does feel more Christmassy because back home it's obviously always cold um, so anyway I thought we were going for lunch and then me and Elliot went on a walk this morning and he decided to tell me that we're not going for lunch we're actually going away for a few days and he texted my boss and cleared it with work and wouldn't tell me where we were going and I freaked out basically because I hate surprises um, and Elliot loves surprises so he just keeps trying to surprise me and think I like it um, so yeah we're now on our way to Port Stephens for a few nights and I cannot bloody wait we're staying at Bannister so it's not going to be very Christmas Eve probably although they might have Christmas decorations up won't they it did go down probably how you planned did it no well, you're an ungrateful bitch for start, so <laughs> I really, that. I really freaked out and I was like, no, I can't, I'm too busy, I've got stuff at work, I've got a facial on Monday night, and then I kept going through, I was like, all these reasons I couldn't do it, and then, and then Elliot was like, I've cleared it with Ellie, your boss, like, it's fine. I was, I was like, literally trying to convince her to come on a getaway <laughs> with me. <laughs> but he didn't sell it to me, he said it's even... It was a bit awkward. It was awkward. It wasn't awkward. It wasn't awkward. But you wouldn't tell me where we're staying. And then he said, we'll go to Newcastle. And I was like, I don't want to go to Newcastle. I just want to go for lunch and buy a Christmas tree. Anyway, we're on the way now. And I'm really excited because I know that we're going to Port Stephens. And we're staying at Bannister's Hotel, which we've been to before. But the Port Stephens one, we haven't stayed in. And I'm so, so excited. So looking forward to it. So anyway, I'm going to stop loving. I hope you enjoy the rest of this vlog. Please give it a thumbs up if you like it. And subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. This is our balcony, that's our room, and this is our balcony. We've got two. <laughs> Why is it so big? Oh my god, I actually can't believe it. We're overlooking the pool and then the ocean over there. Oh, this is insane! Oh my god. Thank you. You're welcome, baby. I love it. Wow, this is such a nice surprise. Okay, I'll show you the room. <laughs> um, so this is the little <laughs> this is the little entrance. I'll actually show you the bathroom first because it's here. Um, so well, I can't get it all in. Maybe I should do this on my camera. But a nice big shower. Um, the sink and then the bath looks out over the ocean. I mean, oh my God, that is actually insane. <laughs> Look at that view. And then come through here. And we've got a gorgeous lounge area, big linen sofa, and then our bed. And dining table. Oh my God. And then out onto the biggest balcony I've ever seen in my whole life. <laughs> wow, wow. All right today, Ellie. Gorgeous. 
Nicholas. Cheers, big <laughs> It's nice and bright at least. It's really nice and bright. Fantabulous. Elliot wanted to go for a walk in the forest. <laughs> Down to the beach. He can't sit still for two minutes. Oh look, that looks nice in there. There's loads of like nice outdoor seating areas. Oh yeah. So that's the hotel behind us and we're just going to walk down to, there's like a pier, so we're going to go and have a look. And I'm going to keep my outfit for koalas because we're surrounded by gum trees where they live. And last time we were in Port Stephens we saw some, just in the wild, crawling around, being cute. Oh, that's a really cute little beach. And the, yeah. So, this just happened. <laughs> oh. Oh. Love you. Love you baby. Safe to say, I'm very surprised. Oh my God, I can't stop looking at my ring. Oh. We've been together four years, but we've known each other for 10 years. And I've loved him for every day. About fucking time. <laughs> Elliot the bird whisperer. <laughs> They're moving away from you. Come on. It's okay. Oh, they're so pretty. <laughs> Literally everywhere we go, Elliot finds birds to feed. Good? <laughs> These are our starters. We've got sourdough. These are sardines on toast. Oh, what's that there? <laughs> um, sardines on toast on sourdough with a salsa verde and then some sashimi. It's pretty beautiful in here. <laughs> We're on our holidays. <laughs> I can confirm that these bathrobes are glorious. So it is like what time is it? It's half eight and the restaurant doesn't open for breakfast until nine, so we're gonna go for a swim because I'm starving. So I need to take my mind off how hungry I am. So we're gonna go for a swim and then Ricky. Ready? Mm. the room we're actually switching rooms tonight because the penthouse wasn't available for two nights in a row so 
we're in a suite next and they're going to move all our stuff for us so we just got to put our bags back together um so room tour number two coming up so we just went to the shops and we were going to go to show bay but we got halfway there and we're both like so tired so we've come back we're in our new room and we are just going to go and lay by the pool i need a nap and um, they've brought all our stuff over i'll actually give you a quick little room tour um but you walk in got a bathroom very similar to before with the like open bath kind of like kitchen hanging area and lounge room tv balcony which goes all the way along and around and then it's got a separate bedroom Hi. <laughs> um, which has a really nice, just, just green view. So a massive cat, um, grasshopper on here. Ew. So I flicked it down like that and the cocoa just came down. Ate it. As soon as it hit the ground, yeah. Oh. You only so, two Oreos in a grasshopper. <laughs> this is a more jungly room. <laughs> jungly? You can see the sea there, it's just there. And there's another bathroom which is just a shower room. <laughs> this is the best game ever if you've watched any of my other vlogs. <laughs> You'll have seen us playing this because we're obsessed with it. And yes, we did bring it with us because we're sad. <laughs> We've walked to the end of the pier because of people fishing. And Elliot loves a bit of small talk with people. <laughs> he can't help it. I'm, see what I catch I'm boring him. And he saw some people on the pier and he said, we need to go down there. And we're always walking on the pier because why wouldn't you? you There's a pier, you've got to walk to the end of it. That's the rule. I've never known anyone to love chatting to other people as much as you. I don't know, it's just like when they're doing something interesting like fishing. It's so interesting fishing, yeah. <laughs> some yeah. people just, I think some people with lower IQs just don't really appreciate it when they start fishing. Oh, right. <laughs> anyway, they haven't caught anything yet. No, we just caught a fishing rod. <laughs> Do you see? Yeah. <laughs> caught an old fishing rod. You know what they say? Teach a man to fish. And he catches a fishing rod. He feeds everyone. <laughs> <laughs> you would be fishing every day for the rest of your life. Elliot said he was going to propose on the pier, but then there was loads of fishermen. But the beach is a bit more me, next to a palm tree, so you chose the right spot. Yeah, it was just one. Cheers. Mm -mm. On to game number two. Ten. Thirty. Thirty-one. Right. Oh, he hasn't got the balls. <laughs> you got my nose. 30? Did I say 30? Yeah, 31. <laughs> <laughs> Elliot, get it out. They know what they're doing, don't they? Another round? Yes. <laughs> you don't mind if I do. Yeah. <laughs> oh. He has like a nice mighty bird. <laughs> you look like an angry bird now, actually. <laughs> um, but we've just got ready after a day by the pool. We had quite a lot of margaritas and had a really nice afternoon. So we just came back to the room and got ready and we're gonna have a few drinks on the balcony and then go for dinner. Um, we're just gonna go to the Mexican restaurant um, in the hotel tonight called Julio's. And I'm wearing this black 
Is it recording? I'm wearing this black, blackless dress. Looking very sunken. The hotel gave us a bottle of champagne in our room when we got here. Said congratulations, love from Bannisters. Um, so we're gonna crack it now because we were like, what, why the hell not? Um, but yeah, we spent the afternoon by the pool and although it was cloudy, it was really hot and we both managed to get burnt. So, result. <coughs> Woo! <laughs> Cheers. Good morning. Dinner was really good. We went to Julio's, which is the Mexican in, um, in the hotel. Um, the steak was really expensive, uh, but it was good, but like not probably worth that much. But anyway, it was yum really yummy. We were really quite pissed, um, but we had a great time, didn't we? We went back to our room and had a cup of tea in bed, um, which is just hilarious, because we're old. Um, but anyway, we've got up, it's 8.21, and we've got massages at 8.30. Um, unfortunately, Bannister's Spa was fully booked, so we're just going to another spa that they've recommended um, in town for a massage, and then we're gonna go back and have breakfast. How do you feel after your massage? <laughs> you look so damned in this slash burn. Oh my god. <laughs> really cold and it's just started raining but we're at, we came to Shell Bay um, if you watch my van trip vlog to Sydney to Byron van trip um, this was our first stop and our last stop on the way back actually um, <laughs> this is very different when it's sunny it's pretty chilly now but it is a cute little beach and there's a really nice restaurant here um, which is a vibe called Chol Bay Country Club and they've just opened a new Greek restaurant but we couldn't go yesterday because it was closed um but yeah we're gonna head back to Sydney in the next half an hour hour because the weather's cold we got them from the supermarket oh I've got a balloon thief <laughs> where are you going with that one <laughs> He, I think he wants to bring it home. <laughs> How cute is this from Emma and Dave? Oh, so nice. Aww. <laughs> that is fun, isn't it? I bet Hunter's really cute. Uh, we've just got home. Um, wow, I look really eggy right now. Um, we just got home and Emma and Dave, my neighbours, had left champagne and balloons and a nice card for us which is so cute they were in on it um and they had the key i had they had a key to our flat from because uh, the cleaner came while we were away so um yeah they set it all up and it's so cute and then hugo and hunter came in and popped loads of the balloons we're actually going for dinner now um at olivia and susan's with the rest of our neighbors they are the neighbors who actually moved out and um, they've invited us all over for dinner so we're going there so it'll be a really nice way to kind of Spend our first night back in Sydney with everyone celebrating. David's son. David son. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you spread that like. You Does it matter if there's little great creases in it? Ah. Hey. Does it matter if there's little creases in it? No, it doesn't. Then. Oh, God. <laughs> See, yeah. Sorry, Bart. Yeah, wow. wow. Oh my god, yum. He's like, yeah. He's like, I'm Oh, you're the most handsome elf I've ever seen. <laughs> this is the main event. Oh my god. Is that a good Leo? <laughs> yum. <laughs> Good morning, the sun is shining and I'm so happy to be back in Sydney um, to some nice blue skies. I've just parked up at Rose Bay because I've got an event at the boathouse um, and then I'm going back into work. So I can't wait to see all the work girls and show them my ring. Um, 
but yeah first is an event at the boathouse it's for a brand called liar which is a non-alcoholic drink they do like a gnt a vodka soda thing i think um and this morning's like their launch event um for their non-alcoholic cocktails so can't wait to see them um i've invited jamie along with me as well so you probably follow her but if not i'll leave her at below so you can have a look at her instagram um she is someone i've just met through instagram basically and she's really lovely and yeah i invited her this morning we're both running really late so i'm gonna park up here and then walk to the event and i'll show you around <laughs> Without been watching today for so long, it'd be a miss for me not to touch on the bubbles that you guys would have received on entry. Cheers. Cheers. Sorry, let me just cheers you. And this is Jamie. Thank you. <laughs> We've had such a nice morning. And wow. we have another event tonight. <laughs> so, so see you then. <laughs> oh, good evening. Um, we are just on our way to the Langham. I feel very short. Sorry, it's because I'm really tall. Event number two of the day. Um, so we're here for the Christmas carol, Christmas tree lighting, which we probably miss, but You're very Christmassy, I'm very summery. You're like you're like London. I'm like Sydney. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is what I would wear at Chris Christmas in London. But anyway, oh, um, we're meeting Jamie at the Langham as well, and yeah, I'll show you around. It's fucking boiling. <laughs> there better be a drink. It's a wonder the spell I'm under because of the chill in the air. <laughs> As we carry 